Wildum. Arcia. Here's Oswaldo Arcia. And he's a bit tardy there on the first pitch fastball. It's nothing in one. That look says it all in the third base dugout. That's not the look of a guy who's going to be sleeping well tonight, is it? Ball one. Would you say he's not really finishing his pitches at this point? That's a good way to put it. It looks like he's aiming a little too much, and that's not working for him. Swing, hard hit ball to second. Throw on to the first baseman, Loney, and the side is retired. But the Twins do strike for three, all coming on this three-run home run. Last chance for the Rays coming up. It's now an 8 nothing ball game. James Loney will be tasked now with leading things off in their half of the ninth as they'll try to do something to prevent being shut out. And whatever they've done for the first eight innings hasn't yielded a whole lot so far. So, quite frankly, I'm not expecting too much. But this will be taken in at second base. Good positioning for the first out. The left fielder, number 20. Steven Souza will stand in. He popped out in his last time. Caleb Fieldbar will come in now working with a huge lead, so he'll just look to get some work in here. Steven Souza will try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Steven Souza. Here's the first pitch to him. Foul back. Now the pitch. That's in there, and he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Boy, no messing around here in this ninth inning. And that's a closer's mentality. They're not usually the best at setting guys up. They're going to come right at you with their best pitch, and that's usually a fastball. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at 2-2. Two and two. Here it comes. And a breaking ball down and in here as he's got to hop out of the way there. Well, it looked like he had things in control to start him out. You know, now he's running from 0 and 2 to 3 and 2, and that last one wasn't even close. And Hunter won't get there. It's off the wall, and he's in there safely. He's got a double. Well, I got to tell you, that's not the way you're hoping to make an entrance into this ball game. First battery faces, and bang! This ball just about leaves the yard, winds up hitting off the outfield wall, and now he's going to have to deal with a runner on second base. And this is going to be a foul ball. He's ready now, the pitch. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. Ready with another 0-2. And a good two-strike swing here as he's been fighting off some tough pitches, but the count will remain at 0-2. And, and boy, what a battle brewing here as he fouls yet another pitch into the seats. Still stuck on 0-2. And, and here's a changeup in there for a called third strike. And that's the second out of the inning. As Drupal Cabrera will dig in, he singled his last time around. Now a swing and a sharp ground ball to third. And with that, I can finally say the four words I've had on my mind for what seems like an eternity. This ball game is over. And I think just about everybody wound up having a hand in this victory as they go on to win this one by eight runs. One final check of the line score as you see the key players there in this shutout victory.
Time to hand out Topps player of the game honors for this one. And guys, I think we can all agree that this fellow right here deserves it more than anybody that took the field in this one. Well, he winds up with three quarters of the cycle. Couldn't quite squeeze in the triple, but that's all right. Definitely did enough to earn himself the hardware. So that'll just about do it. For Eric Harrow, Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show.